I think. Leaning that on something. And I'm gonna do a cyanotype. So I get my coated paper, my negative. And I put the negative facing up, coated paper facing down towards the UV lights. Close it. And having done tests today, that I'll show in a second, I've worked out that 300 seconds is the optimal exposure. So set it to that and off it goes. So I tried with that same negative on three different settings. 100 seconds, 300 seconds, and 720 seconds. And as you can probably see, 300 seconds is the, is the best exposure. So that's, uh, that's the one I'm gonna stick with for negatives. For an object, I tried 300 seconds. That went away. And 600 seconds, 300 seconds, 600 seconds. There's more detail in this one. So I would go for a 600 second exposure for an object with detail, feather. I tested the entire area of the UV unit, coated a piece of paper the exact size and put it, put it in for 540 seconds as a test and the whole area has exposed evenly. I also did test strips at the start of the day um, using the, the same cyanotype chemicals and at the bottom here is three minutes and you can possibly hopefully see a line but then six nine twelve and fifteen minutes are all quite indistinguishable and that's what led me to the kind of five to ten minute exposure as being kind of optimal I think beyond that, you're not gaining anything with this cyanotype process. So that's it just finished. It's 300 second exposure. Open it up. And that's the cyanotype before being washed and this is what the result is after it's been washed and dried so it's exactly the same process for um, a different technique called our gyrotype and again the paper is coated the negative is laid emulsion side up and the paper is laid emulsion side down but I found during tests today that the optimal exposure for a negative for this process is 60 seconds only very short shorter than I expected so I set this to 60 It does take a while when you're scrolling from a quite a high number to quite a low number. Right, 60 seconds and start that. So after the 60 second exposure and then a wash and a fix in the dark room and this was the result. So quite happy with that, having started off with um, just a 200 second exposure but 
way too dark. So 60 is what I would recommend from a negative like this one.